Hello YouTube, this is Praveen back with a video showing you how to turn your Windows 10 laptop into a Wi-Fi hotspot easily without using any software. There are few third party tools like Virtual Router Plus, Connectify etc. But they are not much needed to create a hotspot using laptop that runs with Windows 10 operating system. If you would like to know how to do it using a software Virtual Router Plus, check this video. Please do not skip anyway while learning how to create Wi-Fi hotspot in Windows 10. Do watch it till the end. Step 1. First of all, you need to check whether your laptop supports this feature or not. So to do it, open Run with Administrative Rights. Let me show you how. Simply search for CMD and right click on the command prompt. Then select Run as Administrator. Click S if the User Control dialog box pops up. Now we have Command Prompt with Administrative Rights. To check the compatibility of your laptop, do run the following command. You will find the list of commands in the description of this video. Net sh space wlan space show space drivers. This will bring you wlan info. Here you need to have hosted network support as S. If your laptop shows no, sorry your laptop won't support you to create virtual hotspot. Step 2. Hoping that your laptop has hosted network support, here is the step 2 to proceed. Now come back to command prompt having administrative rights. Run the following commands in series. Net sh space wlan space set space hosted network space mode is equal to allow space ssid is equal to space key is equal to here ssid means the name you would like to broadcast this could be anything and the key means the password you can enter your desired password here I am entering SSID name as TechMT and the key as password, then hit enter. Now we will get the following messages in order. Now enter the second command net sh space wlan space start space hosted network. This particular command will start the created hosted network in previous step with SSID as TechMT. You will get message stating that the hosted network has been started. Before moving to share the wired or wireless connection, let us see the virtual hotspot properties by entering the third command in sequence. Net sh space wlan space show space hosted network. So from the details, we can conclude that we have created hosted network successfully with SSID name as TechMT. Step 3. The process is not yet completed. We need to share our wired or wireless connection to make this method work. Now open run by pressing windows plus R keys. Then enter ncpa.cpl which will open you the network adapter settings. Please listen carefully. I am now using wireless connection on my laptop. So my active connection is Wi-Fi. The local area connection is the one which we got after starting the hosted network through command prompt. If you connect your laptop with cable, your active connection would be Ethernet. Please keep this in mind. As my active internet connection is Wi-Fi, I am sharing it to turn my Windows 10 laptop into a Wi-Fi hotspot. To do this, right click the active internet connection, select properties. Here move to sharing tab and check. Allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection. And then select virtually created hosted network from the drop down menu. In my case it was local area connection. Uncheck the second option then confirm the changes by pressing OK. Step 4. Now take your device that you would like to connect it with hotspot created. Open Wi-Fi settings and check for the broadcaster SSID name. As my SSID is TechMD, I am connecting through it. It will prompt you to enter the password. Enter the key that we have created in step 2. Mine is password. 
Just wait for few seconds until it gets connected. You can see here, I am now browsing the internet with the hotspot we have just created. You can turn off the hosted network by running the simple command through command prompt by opening it as run as administrator. Net sh space wlan space stop space hosted network. That's it. If you face any issues, do comment below or contact me directly on Twitter. Do share or thumb up this video if it found useful. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more tutorials. Your contribution is more to us. This is Pramin signing off. Hope to see you in my next video. Thank you.